here at the CTMP, otherwise known as Mosport, race number seven and race number eight this weekend. It's the third fastest track in the world. It's right here in our backyard. And uh, you know what? It's home sweet home for uh, some of us Canadian drivers. Started my career here. You know, there's a lot of pressure. There's uh, a lot of fans, the home track, you know, a lot of uh, expectation gets put on yourself uh, by yourself. This track's pretty much unique in the sense that it's very high speed, very demanding of the driver of the car. The minimum speeds here, I think, for GTS is around 114 miles an hour. I hope to be fast. I hope to show some pros what's capable of these KTM crossbows and uh, have a really good showing for the team. So going into Qualify, I actually felt fairly confident. The KTM Expo has uh, a lot of downforce. It's an aero car. We thought it would do very well here. And you know what? All honesty, just didn't bring it. I didn't have my best game. I qualified P11. Should have been up in the, you know, anywhere five through seven kind of a thing. Just didn't really have my A game and I paid the price by ending up in P11. In the beginning of qualifying, you know, I was a little apprehensive. You know, it took me three, four laps to really lay down the good one. I just really kind of had to shock myself into, okay, just don't drive the car. You gotta drive the car on the edge. You know, Andrew had confidence in the car and in me that I could get it done. And I did it. Brought the car in in P2. And ultimately finished in P4 after a couple guys went faster than me. Didn't even feel like it was a fast lap. You know, Jacques Delaire say, you know you got it right when he doesn't feel like you're driving fast at all. really excited to get to race day today. Nerves settled in a little bit, which that doesn't really happen to me anymore. I was feeling really good. I was fourth place. I knew the guys that I was surrounded with were gonna be fast. To start, there was cars everywhere. There was cars sliding, there was cars diving inside, outside, and that was only in corner one. I didn't have a really strong turn one, unfortunately. I lost a couple positions, foot into it rolled uh, three wide going through uh, turn two and made those positions up and into turn three I was able to grab another position on one of the expos that had uh, qualified in front of me. That was my mindset, not to let these guys get away. The first few laps they didn't. We were on cold tires. This car is light. It doesn't really warm tires up very quick and I was staying with them. Really awesome battling with Brett Sandberg and, and another KTM and uh, Nate Stacy in one of the Roush Mustangs. How the three of us were just bumper to bumper, door to door. We weren't that fast in the straight line and going into five, I could catch guys. I couldn't get by them and a couple of times I dive bombed inside, a couple of times I dive bombed outside. We just, just didn't have the speed to get by. Myself and a Maserati, I don't know how many times we've, we've swapped positions back and forth over the course of the race. I had about four laps to go. I was holding my own ahead of the Maserati, and for two laps in a row, uh, the car got loose on me in uh, turn five. This particular Maserati, once again, ran me up the back straight. I just had nothing for him, and uh, I lost that last position. You know, finishing eighth place today, I think, I think it's something to be proud of. We might not have the fastest car here, but I think we've learned a few things to, to make us go faster and be more competitive for tomorrow. Uh, Martin's in 10th today, and I'm in 12th. Standing start this morning. I hope everybody gets off clean, so if not, there's potential for uh, chaos. Today, it's about driving smooth. It's about driving the way I, I know this car likes to be driven. Here to have some fun, do the best we can, and we're gonna work hard doing it. Right after coming out of the pits, I might have been a little too anxious on the throttle and spun. When I knew I was clear, I actually started to laugh because it's such a rookie move. It's one of those things in racing that happens and there's nothing more you can do. Sitting on a red line, waiting for the lights to go out, and instead of just dumping the clutch, I slipped a little bit, lit right up. Coming off the outside of one, gave up a position, grabbed that position back, found the outside of two and was able to grab at least another position, rolled down into three, went to the outside uh, of three for another pass. I 
started from the back of the pack after I spun. It was going well. It's going into three. There was a sin car that had tank slap in front of me and almost took me out. After the first caution, we got right back at it after about 20 minutes of cleanup. Well, you know what? Another yellow comes out. After, I think, over 10 laps, we got back to racing. So a lot of the race was under yellow. Didn't give me an opportunity to make any passes. I think maybe we had three laps after the restart. Just close battling. Mustang got in around me, had bigger legs down the back stretch. One of the other competitors in a sin car, I'm afraid, got around me. They got some killer mile an hour on us up the back straight. In the last lap of the race, the green lotus that was in front of me gave me an opportunity to pass, and I took it. He decided to make contact with me. If you're gonna do any passing on this track, it's, it's very tight to do so, and usually at high speed. I outbroke him into corner eight and uh, finished the race in, in P9. A couple cars got into it going through nine, and I just decided to stay in it and hopefully find some clearer track, and as it turned out, I was able to pass one of the other KTMs, likely 10 feet before the finish line. You know, all in, a great race for the team, a great race for myself. Gives us some momentum to carry into Lime Rock. I think it's a better suited track for our cars. It's a tight track. I think we're gonna see contact there between cars. I'm hoping for a good result there. <laughs>